Hey, so my Heritage app is just going viral in, in the top charts of the US App Store right now. So why is that? Uh, I think the website has been there for a while, myheritage.com, but the, the killing feature is this animated photos when, where you can just upload old photos or you can just take any photos and you can use my heritage AI technology and make these photos moving. Also, you can colorize them, you can make them much better looking. So you can add these photos, either scan them or add from your photo library. And yeah, other than that, this app has another like super cool features like DNA tests and like discovery, matching. So I'll just do like super quick overview of the app right in this video. So just watch it, all the features, just like a quick glance, like what you can do. And of course, I will show you how to exactly animate photos. You don't need to pay for it. You can just create a free account. Uh, but I think you will need to add your credit card because there is like a 14 day free trial. But anyways, just here is the quick overview. Here is the app. It's in top uh, charts of the app store right now. So I'll just show you here. So here is the app. It's free to download. Uh, however, there is like a 14, 14 day free trial. Um, so yeah, you will, to create an account, uh, you will need to add your card. So I tried to create an account here via mobile app and it didn't work. Maybe because there were like just, um, tons of people trying to download the app right now. Um, so the way to do it is you need to go to myheritage.com website, uh, create an account, add your credit card, uh, and then yeah, uh, get your password and then you can log in to the mobile app. So that's what worked for me. Um, so yeah, there are a lot of features to this app and it was there quite for a while. They have like a big website. Uh, so you can build your uh, family tree. Uh, you can research your family history. Uh, and then there is a fully integrated DNA testing. Uh, so that's really cool. But the main feature why it's going super viral right now is it because of this colorize and enhance your family photos feature. So you can upload some old photos and you can make them moving or you can colorize them. And so that's super amazing. So let's just dive into it. So here is the app. So for example, here you have three. You can just add uh, like your family here and then it will be your family tree. Uh, so you can decide which view you want to have and then just add all your family members and then just create your family tree. Then there is like discoveries. Uh, so yeah, uh, you can discover like new facts, relative photos and stories from uh, the billions of historical records and family tree profiles. Uh, so yeah, you can just add, add facts, add specific schools. Uh, and then, yeah, you can uh, get much more information about, uh, you know, like basically family tree. So that's kind of amazing feature as well. So play with it. Then there is DNA. Uh, you can, uh, with simple DNA test, you can order it. Uh, the price is just in Danish kronos because I have downloaded this app in the uh, in Denmark. And then you can see something like you are like, how many percentages are you English, Scandinavian, Italian? What you will discover, the percentage of DNA you share with your matches showing you how closely related you are. Uh, so that's pretty cool. 
Um, I will go back to the photos tab. When this is research, you can search for specific uh, people. You can invite members here. You can invite close relatives. Then there is inbox. So there are like messages and there are settings. So here is your account. Here is support center. Uh, all of that. But now it's the main feature. So it's called photos and you can upload photos uh, just by adding photos from your library or scanning photos and docs. Uh, so yeah, you can just tap to scan and then you can even scan from your like laptop or from PDF. Just, yeah, I can just actually show you, for example, if I, if I try to scan just from the internet somewhere. So for example, here is the photo. And then, yeah, so then it will identify kind of the area. Uh, it, it does it much better just because I'm just scanning from, from laptop. So that's why, uh, but anyways, here are also some example photos. So here is the photo. And then the main feature is called animation. It's in top left part. So there you have it. And then that's what happens. Uh, they're using some AI technology and you can animate your old photos. It can take a few seconds. There are like 10 animations. And then you can just select uh, switch from animation to. So something like that, pretty cool, huh? So, and again, you can just switch. Yeah, so that's that. In top part, you can share it. So you can share it as a video, as a gift to like all the social networks or whatever you want, then you can delete in top part and in top right, you can also save it to your library. Another cool feature, you can just improve the quality of the photo, just compare it, like how amazing is this, right? Uh, yeah, so just do that. And then you can colorize the photo. Uh, maybe it doesn't work on all photos like super well, but yeah, that's where it is. You can add tags to the photo. So you can tag people, you can add uh, uh, like place in the bottom right part. You can tap on mic icon and add like an audio note, note to this app. You can, yeah, so that's that. So that's the main feature, like see on this photo, how like cool is mm, makes like this photo, like uh, super col colorized and uh, so that's pretty cool. So that is the app. Uh, so, but these features are, uh, uh, available for free only for 14 days. So let's just check out pricing. Uh, so subscription pricing. Yeah. Okay. You need to go to their website and check it out there because uh, seems, yeah, it's not possible to upgrade your app store. So, because, um, <clears throat> yeah. 
so it can be like a bit more than hundred dollars per year uh, something like that so it's not that expensive uh, and it has like uh, international versions for uh, like if I'm in the US, it's uh, you need to get like and create an account for myheritage.com if you're in Denmark or whatever, myheritage.dk and stuff like that. But anyways, this is the app. So hope this quick overview was helpful and yeah, have fun.